Here's a tip from Charles Davis of RVFinancing.com about how to avoid a mistake when applying for an RV loan. When you apply for a loan, the bank or other finance company will check your credit, not just with one lending source, but sometimes with many. This is especially true when you apply for a loan on the Internet. And each time that credit is checked, your credit score goes down. That's why it's important to ask your finance company how many times it plans to check your credit before approving or disapproving your loan. That you go to, they're going to put it once. The credit union is going to pull it once. That's all. But on the Internet, unless you ask them or make specific, uh, specific statements, you only want your credit pulled once or twice, they could pull your credit ten times. And that, of course, drops your score. The more they pull your credit, the more your score goes down. Okay? It will drop your credit score two to three points every time your credit is pulled. Let's say you're at a 720 or 718, which is a good credit score, and you decide to you just tr oh, do an application online and, 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 and you didn't ask the person how many times you pull your credit, whatever. And it's one of those folks that pull your credit eight or ten times. Well, there's a very good possibility you're now below 700. New interest rules for you. You've been a good boy all your life, but I just killed you. In 60 to 90 days, your credit score will come back up above 700. But until then, you don't want to buy an RV because your rate's going to be higher. The higher your credit score, the lower your rate.